Break is also affecting the faithful. The Green Bay Catholic Diocese has issued words of caution for churchgoers. Local 5's Aaron Taylor live now with more. Aaron. Tom, Aaron, the Lenten season means large crowds at church, and large crowds mean a higher risk of spreading illnesses like the coronavirus. I spoke with church officials today about the extra precautions they have decided to put in place. For churchgoers, Lent is a busy time of year. People usually practice more, so they would come to Mass more uh, and participate in communal events. Those communal events have become a concern as the coronavirus continues to spread across the country. That's why temporary guidelines have been set in place for the Diocese of Green Bay. It's very consistent with what we typically issue during the flu season, the cold and flu season. Officials say the diocese has received a flurry of calls and emails from parishioners concerned about the potential spread of the virus. During communion, that's the biggest opportunity to contract the virus. And so ministers are now being asked to wash their hands before and after serving communion. And a normal staple of the practice will not be offered. So the chalice is not the, not an option at this time. Another tradition that is undergoing adjustments is the sharing of the peace when parishioners would typically shake hands. Share the sign of peace in a different way, a non-physical way. So whether it be a hand, head nod or an opportunity to just say, peace be with you. If you're already displaying symptoms of the cold or flu, there's only one guideline you need to know. So we want to make sure that we help people understand that uh, they have no obligation to come to Mass if they are physically sick. All of these precautions in place until the threat of coronavirus officially subsides. That would be when we would likely issue another statement to say that these restrictions are no longer in effect. And for more information on these temporary guidelines, you can head to our website. That's wearegreenbay.com. Live in Alloway, Aaron Taylor, Local 5 News.